can you take us what? Can you take us to the last three balls where you eat? Three clean sixes and one again uh, for the team. Can you take us to that one? Yeah, I mean, I think we once we got it down to maybe like 15 or 16 overalls or four overs, you know, we only really needed one one decent over, um, you know, and I felt taking on Paris was probably the easier option, um, you know, um, than, than maybe taking on the spinner. So, uh, yeah, look, he, he just, he put them in the area and, you know, it was probably more out of frustration than anything else, you know, I, I, I went for them and, and look, thankfully, you know, got enough batting them just to go over ropes. Were you aware about the qualifying situation? Did you recommend to be uh, no, I wasn't. I wasn't. It was win. Um, so I mean, I don't really care who goes through in fourth place, whether it's Chitwan or or Bratney, or you know. So, but I was just concentrating on winning the game and trying to get into the the top two. You have been one of the integral parts in the team's victory. How does it feel to win the match? Here? You already previously said that you want to play uh, cricket in front of this crowd, and you're doing it. Uh, you're winning the game for the team. How how is the feeling now? Yeah, that's, I'm very proud of my own personal performances. Um, you know, obviously coming over to a new tournament, you know, under new a new uh, team owner and, and, and a franchise, you know, you want to play well. Um, you know, put your put your best performances on the pitch, and, and thankfully the last four games have gone well um, for me personally. Um, you know, but there's still two or three big games left for us. So you know, we starting back here tomorrow. If we can, you know, hopefully we can play a bit better than we did against Lalitpur last time, and you know, we've got a bit of revenge yeah, on our hands. How do you how do you watch the game uh, when you are in the non-striker and and a Nepali player is batting? How is it how is it like uh, watching from the non-striker? It's like watching when anyone else is batting. You know, I just want to get back on strike. So you know, I'm just trying to urge, c continuously tell the guys to you know be positive, take the aggressive option without you know a reckless shot. You know, just looking to continually rotate the strike because you know in 2020 if a player is off strike for a long period of time, it's it's quite hard to get back into the rhythm of the innings. So. I think that's what happened a little bit today with me. You know, I, I was off strike for a long period of time. Um, you know, and I probably affected my tempo and the rhythm of my innings. Yeah, I knew he'd be watching uh, in his in his bedroom. You know, and he'd, I knew he'd be cheering cheering us on to, to win the game. So uh, yeah, so hopefully now he'll be in a good mood later on tonight. How do you take the opening now? Patriot, what does it take for about the opponents? You lost that game as captain uh, quite convincingly, right? So yeah, very convincingly, I think. Yeah, yeah. it was fairly one sided. And, and you're playing them once again. What, what's your thought on it? Oh, listen, I think we didn't play very well last time. Um, but the, uh, the, the positive thing is we, we've seen them play. We know we know their strengths and weaknesses. Um, you know, I still I still think we were in a good position when we were batting. You know, to get 150, 160. You know, I think we were 70 odd for four or ten overs. Um, you know, I think I, you know, and then we lost a couple of wickets. So I still think, you know, if we had played slightly better with the bat, you know, we, we would have posted a better score at the last game. Um, but you know, tomorrow's a new day, a new wicket. Uh, we're full of confidence now. We've won three in a row, and we're we're, we're looking good.